Welcome everybody, very happy to be there. So Jean-François Dufour, liver specialist in Switzerland. I discovered hepatology at the end of my uh, internal medicine training. And um, it was for me quite interesting to see that through the liver, actually all the different specialties of medicine are there. You see patients with psychiatric disorders, you see patients with metabolic disorders, you see physiology, you see metabolism, you see uh, cancer. So all aspects of internal medicine is there and that's make quite attractive. Another thing which I also liked in hepatology is are the patients. You see patients um, that you get to know for years because it's chronic disease. And so you see these patients over many years um, when everything goes well and you treat them well. And uh, they are coming from all corners of the society. And that's, I think, is quite fascinating. So I uh, trained in uh, Switzerland, in Geneva, in medicine when I got my uh, MD degree. Then I moved to, which was the only liver unit at that time in Switzerland, in Bern, Switzerland. And from there, I went in Boston to work with uh, Win Ayers in research for several years, working on bile canaliculus a long time ago. And then I switched for the clinical part and the clinical program in the same institution at Tufts University in Boston, when I work with um, someone who uh, was a legend in primary biliary cholangitis, uh, um, Marshall Kaplan. It was fantastic to work with Marshall. Yes. And then I moved back to Switzerland when I'm working here now in Bern. Currently I'm working on two aspects, but actually also in the intersection of these two aspects. I'm interested in non-alcoholic state with hepatitis and also in hepatocellular carcinoma, and especially then in the risk to develop hepatocellular carcinoma in patients with NASH. What I like about uh, liver disease is it was also something which attracts me in this field is that the way when I began my training in hepatology, the hope to have drugs to treat um, liver diseases. And effectively now we have drugs to treat hepatitis B, we have the vaccine to prevent hepatitis B, we cure patients with hepatitis C. So in a matter of a few decades, the field changed completely. And now we see the same progresses in uh, liver cancer and also probably in the next year in NASH. Who knows? Well, I hope you enjoy this small profile, and I hope also that you will be able to attend the UEG Week virtual on the 11th and 13th of October. And there are some interesting talks, like for example, one on COVID-19 that I will uh, give uh, um, on transplant and COVID-19.